Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to install photo cell on this light and the light will go outside this room. So the procedure is really simple. Uh, right here I have the diagram which shows how to connect the sensor. This sensor is supposed to react on the movement. The exact model you can see here. LC G01. And the light is 10 watt IP66. It should be water resistant. The, the case is all metal. Yeah, so we will see how that goes. Uh, now what I need to do is connect the sensor with the light and the cable which we will use for the power. Now we will uh, connect the sensor according to the diagram here. It says that live wire needs to go to the brown or black wire on the sensor which is this one the live wire goes on the live wire from the power cable <clears throat> I will use some of uh, these plastic connectors you can split them and use them or you can just uh, solder the wires but I don't have time for that right now, so I will just use the pliers to split the connector into two. So the live wire goes here. So we put in the live wire. Maybe need to I will make it shorter. So unscrew a little bit like so and put in. Of course always do this when the cable is not plugged in the electricity if you want to avoid any dangerous situations and stuff so next one is this it's brown wire or black wire which goes to the live directly we cut as well like so next step is to connect the ground or the blue wire with the blue wire of the light and of course with the main from the main going from the main cable so to do this we will connect the two blue wires from the sensor and the blue wire from the light So basically all three blue wires are connected together. Blue wire from the light, blue wire from the sensor and to the neutral or the power cable. So once you do that you can leave it to be like so. The next step is to connect the red wire from going from the sensor and to the light as you can see here on the 
diagram red wire goes to the load wire of the light there finally <clears throat> so we need the red wire from the sensor and the live wire from the light but for the time being I will just connect it like so so that should be it according to the, this according to this diagram now I will test and we will see what happens so this light should react as I suspected this light is actually for the night time as you can see it turns on if it is night time and not the moment at least it works so it's really simple to connect as you can see if the if it's darkness it will turn on the light if it's daytime it will turn off and that's basically its function fun functionality um, now I will disassemble everything and mount it outside where I wanted it to be so let's move on to next segment the light and the sensor are now mounted as you can see right here I isolated the contacts between the light and the sensor and here you can see how it works as soon as it is dark there you go the cable goes around here inside on the switch which you can use to turn on or off the light and the rest of the cable simply goes to the power socket here yep so that's all um thank you for watching the channel now has 100 subscribers please consider liking and subscribing if you didn't already i plan to film a bit more and hopefully i, I get better on the talking part and everything else editing and so so for now bye bye